Nom 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 Bowser Jr.'s robot reactor. I will shoot you in the eye, Bowser! Huh. Yeah, I have it. I did it. These galaxies are not galaxies are not shaped like Bowser's. Bowser heads. They are just Bowser heads on the map. The map. Here is the map. And that Mega Leg's moon. I guess that's the moon and that is Mega Leg. That giant robo thing. And we have glass spheres. We can't be we can't destroy them. How are we ever gonna destroy it? I've seen, um, I've done this glitch where you can get up on top of this thing. You double and then triple off of it or something. Well, op you triple off of some sort of high point on this thing. But the way to destroy these things is by using this bullet bill, guiding it into these things. Roll off star! There's also star bits and coins and one ups, but I don't care. Yeah. Yeah, so you can glitch up to this moon um, without the launch star by triple jumping. Because gravity is weird in this game. Uh, and the only way to trigger this cutscene is by stepping on this spot. But otherwise, you can just mess around with the place. Just not. just ab doing absolutely nothing. Hmm. That's a big robot. I don't think we want to be squished by it, because it's a one-hit KO. Yeah, you want to get on it when it's green. No, when it's red, it's just like shooting, that's all. Or, no, when it's red, it's lifting its foot. And you got these. Why is that hard? <laughs> it's not supposed to be. Uh, and then we just use the bullet bill. And there's the Grand Star giving this robot power. Oh no, offense. Hey, can I have a bullet bill? Ow. Hey, hit that thing. Aw, uh, you suck. Aw, uh, you suck. Yeah, that defense will, um, will always regrow. Will always re reappear. Ah. Uh. But it's good to destroy the fence because then the bullet bill can get in easier. There we go. And for some reason, just because the Grand Star is gone, the entire thing blows up. Oh my god. <laughs> This is a violent game. Not cool. I'm violent. All Mario games are violent. Depends on how you look at them. Yeah, I know. Like, for instance, there's always lots of explosions. And in this game, you can like stomp on the Luma's heads. It's like, ow, ow, ow! Stop stepping on me! Ow! Stop stepping on me! It's kind of cool. Um, here I'll show you. I will show you. As soon as stuff stops happening, that ball of flame represents the power of the observatory. We call it the beacon. Every time you get a grand story, you unlock a new dome. Hi. He's gonna play Angry Birds, my guys! Do the volume now. <laughs> I haven't even started. I was even doing Angry Birds. Oh. Yeah, sure, I'll keep it down. Well, I saw Angry Birds on the screen. Yeah, you know, we would hate our viewers to be confused. As about... to which game we're playing. Right, that's right, because if they saw Mario and heard Angry Birds... What is like... this, Angry Mario or <laughs> Mario <laughs> Birds? I was gonna say that. Super Birds. Super Angry Birds Galaxy. <laughs> Super angry Mario Galaxy. And so we unlocked a new- so, so here, you can jump on things. 
And and when you use the homing ground pound, you home in on them, so you can keep doing this forever and ever as long as you your arm doesn't get tired. Oh yeah, you don't jump on her head. Watch. She has a force field. What the heck? Oh yeah, and when you talk to these uh, black women, they show you a map, and you can look at stats and all that. Okay, so we are going to the fountain dome. We already have two galaxies unlocked there because we got so many stars. Got all the stars from the first dome that we can get. Yeah! Fountain! Water! I'm gonna play in the water! Ha <laughs> ha And then I'm gonna jump out and be covered in water. Uh, that guy didn't say anything apparently. So... Two choices. Space Junk Galaxy or Rolling Green Galaxy. Tell me in the comments if you want. I'm probably not... I'm, no, I'll, I'll just do Rolling Green Galaxy. Since I have time left in the video. Rolling in the clouds. So this introduces a new mechanic that is very weird and stupid and no one likes it and... Well, it doesn't appear much, which is good. Because it's really hard. Okay. So here we have a uh, billboard. Or maybe it's fillboard. Or gillboard. Alright, so now we want to hold our remote up. No, Gil. Because Gil is a name, Phil is a name, and Bill is a name, and it's a billboard. Yeah, and then you uh, tilt to make the ball roll around. Okay, I don't care what you're saying, Mr. Billboard. And then, yeah, I say to jump and do stuff. And those things make you jump. Oh. Whee! I'm gonna keep rolling around in this thing. I'm gonna go down, and then it rolls automatically. Look at Mar Mario turns into a ball and rolls. I'm gonna be there hardcore and follow this star bit trail. Eek. Yuck. It's really hard, actually. It's harder than it looks. Seriously. Ah! But I'm so good at this game, I can do anything! I can do all the glitches there is. I have seen lots and lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of glitches. And I have done all, almost all of them. Eek! Don't die! Eek! Don't die! Eek! Don't die! Ah! Mario. Ah! Don't die! Don't die right at the end! Yeah. Yay! Now we have a windmill. Come on! Yeah! Get on the flagpole, Mario! You beat the level, you got the flagpole, you got 5,000 points, yeah! And now when we get the star. Oh yeah! Mm. Fountain. Rolling green galaxy it is complete. Galaxy complete. Star bits! We need a lot of those. What is it, Ray? <laughs> so, next time. Next time. Space junk. And then after we finish that, we go here, whatever this is. I'm not gonna unlock it right now. Okay, bye. 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 Go away, will ya? Just go away!